to access funnels section press the funnels in the sidebar now you will see an option to create a new funnel press on it to start creating a new funnel first of all you'll need to name this funnel i'll name it a block funnel every funnel has a minimum of two steps and it can have more steps we can add more steps by clicking add another step this green add another step button I'll remove it for now. First, this is the first page in, in bracket home page, and then this is the last page. This last page depends on websites. For example, mine is a blog. I'll open it in a new tab. This is my blog home page and this is my blog page which is loading just hold on for a second. As I was say, saying this is my blog home page and this is my blog page. This would be my starting step and this would be my ending step. This means that this funnel will track whoever visits my home page and then visits my blog. For different businesses, this may mean different things. For example, if you are an e-commerce website like Amazon, this will be your categories page will be your first page and then the last page will be the checkout page or checkout success page. In between, you can have some pages like cart page, other pages like discounts page, etc. For now, to demonstrate the power, of the funnels tool i will leave it as blog page and click create funnel now the funnel will take time to be generated we will need to wait for some time after the funnel has been generated you can click view funnel to see how your visitors dropped off from one page to the other you see this is my home page that is the first page and this is my last page that is the blog page. I have had 23 se sessions and out of those 23 sessions 34.8% people visited my blog page after seeing my home page. I can click this watch button to see visitor recordings of first page and I can click this watch button to see visitor recordings of last page. In the next lectures we will be talking about creating polls, surveys and hiring test recruiters to test our website. See you in the next lectures.